Hello everyone, welcome back to Physio Activity. In today's video, I'm going to perform uh, shoulder flexion and extension MMT. And this is my patient of today. If you are new to my channel, please do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Let's go. So, for shoulder flexion MMT, always start with great start. For great start MMT, there is full range of motion against gravity with no resistance. I will just suppose the patient over the shoulder joint and then the patient will perform in his own. Perform? Like this. Yes. This is great start MMT. For grade 4 MMT, there is full range of motion against gravity with minimal resistance. I will just suppose the patient over the wrist joint, anterior part of wrist joint, and then the patient will perform the movement. Let's go. For grade 5 MMT, there is full range of motion against gravity with maximal resistance. I will just support the patient over the uh, anterior part of wrist joint and then the patient will perform. Let's go. Good. For grade 2, I will just support over the shoulder joint and then the patient will perform equal to the ground. There is eliminating gravity. Like this. Like this. This is equal to the ground. This is grade 2 MMT. For grade 1, there is flickling contraction just over the anterior part of the deltoid. And then the patient will just try to move the end so that I can feel uh, flickling contraction. Can you perform? Yes, yes, yes. Good. Now, let's go on um, uh, shoulder uh, extension MMT. Now I'm going to perform a shoulder extension MMT. The patient has to be in prone line position and the therapist is just behind the patient. For grade start MMT, there is full range of motion against gravity with no resistance. I will just support the patient just over the shoulder joint and then the patient will perform the movement. Perform. Okay, good. For grade four, there is full range of motion against gravity with minimal resistance. I will just support the patient over uh, the wrist joint and then apply minimal resistance. Let's go. Good. For grade 5 MMT, there is full range of motion against gravity with maximal resistance. I will just apply maximal resistance over the wrist joint and then the patient will perform the movement. Let's go. Good. For grade 2 MMT, the patient has to be in a sideline position, like this. It must be equal to the ground, like this. For grade 1, the patient come back in front line position, like this. And then there is flickering contraction over the posterior part of the deltoid. Good, good. So this is grade uh, one extension of the shoulder joint. So, so guys, this is the end of today's video. Please do not forget to subscribe, like, and share my video. See you.